I'm Jackie Pendleton, I'm the Chief Officer of NHS Kerno. Um, NHS Kerno is an organisation that represents our local GP practices. We've got 59 of them across Cornwall and the Isles of Scilly. And we're responsible for assessing the needs of the population and then purchasing, so buying services to meet those needs within the money that we're given by government. Oh, a whole range of services from general practice itself in terms of the day-to-day -day stuff you'll go and get from your GP practice through to um, urgent operations, through to the emergency department at the Royal Cornwall Hospital or at Plymouth. My name's Ian Chalton, I'm a GP working in Callington in the east of the county and I'm the, the chair of our governing body which is the, uh, uh, our, our board of uh, GPs and uh, uh, other members who, are, who want to assure ourselves about how well we're performing here in Cornwall and the city. We're here for the people of Cornwall and the Isles of Scilly and our responsibility is to, uh, to, to provide the best service we can with the resources we've got. Uh, much of the conversation over the last few years has been all about our finances and our, and our awful financial position and I'm really pleased and proud that this year it's been much more focused on what we do with and for our people and working with our colleagues right across health and social care so our finances have become less part of the conversation. It's around what can we do and how can we do it better. But part of the role of the commissioner is, of course, to make uh, difficult decisions, but to be, to be seen to be doing the best that we can with the, the resources that we've got. And by resources, I mean the people that we have and, and where they work. And people that work uh, with people with health and care problems are not only healthcare professionals, are people working in the local authority in care, and particularly the voluntary sector. We have a fantastic uh, uh, relationship with our voluntary sector. It's a really important part of, of living and being part of Cornwall. Uh, and, and, and what we've seen over the last year is how services are wrapping themselves around people and their, their, their individual needs in, uh, in the place that they live. And that can't be met just by healthcare or just by social care, but it's met by us all working together and recognising what it is that individual people need.